Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Naya Slivers. We're up against Heisenberg. 4602. We won the die roll. We get a crummy one lander. We're going to mulligan. Uh, we can keep this. Yeah, we'll keep. Uh, I think I'll dump the lead. Yeah, let's dump the lead. We got these double tap lands. It's going to be a little gnarly. Let's go thriving. We'll call red just in case. Pass the turn. Let's see what they do here. Thriving Isle. Uh oh. Ooh, it's the Demir. I hope it's not the really crappy version. I played a match last week, and it was the most atrocious version of control I have ever seen in Popper. It was, uh, Asper? Is it Asper? Red? It was like all the colors. No, it was like five color control. It was insane. Insane. I, I didn't know what was happening. I was so lost. Their combos and their they did they had one win combo, and it was just to make a buyback one one token plant token every turn. So eventually they get to like six mana, and then the buyback was like three or four or something. So they had to get up to like nine mana or something like that just to do the buyback to keep bringing it back to their hand to make one token a turn. But they never even did it. They never even did it. It was literally just a bunch of garbage for the whole time. <laughs> All right, this is Thriving Heath, right? All right, let's play. We're going to play out both of these guys, and then we'll slam the Lord next turn. And kill something? Okay. All right. Yeah, it was an insane combo, though. They had so many counter spells, so many, like, four mana counter spells that just kept bringing counter spells back to their hand over and over and over again. The game went on for pretty much the entirety of our clocks and it never actually ended in him dealing me damage. He never dealt me damage once. I would get him down quite a bit. He'd find ways to stall me out and he never once brought me under 20 health, but I just had to concede the game because it was annoying as hell it was the most bizarre thing i'd ever seen we lose our plated let me know if anybody else has went up against that deck it was ridiculous all right let's uh let's go like this just see what we can hit with uh winding way here unless they want to counter it and then we just get down a lord that's fine This is a fine board to have. Be cool to get our range of the lightning bolts that they got running though. And this almost feels like that deck. I mean, they were running um, they were running Scred, I think. But all these, Thriving Bro, Thriving Isle, they're playing with the Ritual of Suit. Uh, is that the new, is that the new card? The new board wipe card, Ritual of Suit? Isn't that it? They were, they were naming black, they were flashing it back, they were doing all sorts of kind of... Oh, oh my gosh, it was gnarly. Alright, we're just going to keep sneaking in for some poisonous at this point. I'm not going to play this lead the stampede until I know I can get away with it, but... This is the part where it gets stupid, if this is the deck. Because they just have four mana, and then they counter something, and then they just bring back their counter spells, lightning bolts, and they just keep going and going and going and going and going. Never ends. Swamp has entered the revealed zone. Oh, geez, we're doing this, huh? Just playing out the Evan cars, Justice. That's cool. No buyback, but th th this is what I'm saying. They have ways to bring it back, so they don't care whatsoever. Uh, we are going to... Do a lead the stampede while we can. Try to refill. 
Good stuff. I like it. We can get something down at least. Start getting back in there with uh, Viverlint. We just got our whole hand back, basically. They killed our Sentinel Viverlint. We're going to drop it again. If they allow us. Viverlint's not as relevant, so I will kind of like toss him to the wind. Let's see if they want to counter him. Don't counter him. Because they know I have the Lords. Well, I'm just going to chill for a minute. They're not doing anything there. They've got two cards in hand. Should I just try? I'm going to try to put something down here. They got two cards in hand at this point, so like, let's get it out of their hand, right? I haven't seen their weird counter spell where they bring stuff back yet, so that's pretty good. If we can keep them low on cards, we'll be able to get these other lords down. Whenever you draw, so this is mill. This is a mill plan. Oh my gosh. All right, well, now I'm not worried at all now that we have a clearer picture of what they're attempting. Yeah, and they know it too. They can't do nothing about our two lords next turn. Okay. Pyroblast for show. Hunter's not relevant. Striking's not relevant. Is Relic relevant? I don't know if Relic is relevant. Let's see in here. Anything of importance? They're just milling. If that's all they're doing, then like we're fine. I don't think I need swift response. Uh, yeah, we'll, um, maybe blade back though. Mm, is this a matchup for blade back? No, I don't think so. Let's run it back. How many colors are they running for? Like this is four color mill. That's such a late Jace's erasure, like, what... They didn't even really draw cards, they... They played one Brainstorm and they were playing with Lightning Bolt. Um... I'm gonna keep this, I'm not super thrilled about it, though. We need to make sure we get to lead the Stampede off, that's... That's about it, if we can refill, I think we'll be okay, but... All our mana's correct? Sure, you know? What can you do? I'm gonna start on a uh, forest here. Pass the turn. Don't like passing the turn against blue with no play. It's a bit unfortunate. They're gonna cycle, get their mana right. Setting up to kill our stuff. I'm not going to do anything. I don't like waiting around. I don't like giving them double blue, but... I know they're just going to shoot my lord down. It doesn't seem worth it right now. Just got to wait for a minute. Alright, so they're finally getting Jace's Erasure down early. Gem hide is... Reasonable. This is a turn I want to be getting lead the stampede, but now we've got a little bit of a hand. Uh, I'll throw a gem hide down. It'll probably die. I'll just get something down, so maybe we can really power out a lot next turn, but. Let's see what they start milling us for. A plane's perfectly fine. It looks like they're a little bit stuck on their mana situation too. 
Okay, how do I want to run this? We've got... They're tricky mountain, man. They're tricky, tricky mountain. I can go... Heart Sliver. Into Lord. Into Lord. It doesn't get out of range of the lightning bolts. Into Plated. They're just going to kill it. It's interesting. I really just want to, like, take advantage of the situation that they're in right now, but... Alright. Let's... Let's start with Heart. Let's see what... Let's see what they do with this. If we can get Heart down, then everything we play is just going to provide us some mana here. Unless it's controller pays two. Alright, so I pay two and then I get a lord down. Or I let it get countered and I play a lord and a plated. Let's just uh, pay the two for it. Again, this guy's probably going to die. Oh, frick, I missed my attack. Fudge. Skipped right through. My bad. It's alright. They kill one thing here. They kill our lord here. We put down another one. We swing for a ton. If they continue to be stuck on mana. Yep. Lightning bolt my lord. Sure. They got their thriving bluff. Which taps for red. What are you going to call? Black? Black. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Let's lead the Stampede first. Cool stuff. I like all of this. We about to pop off now. Let's play our planes. Sentinel. Swing. And then just make him concede, basically. Yeah, we're just going to make him concede. I mean, what are you going to do now? Dead next turn. Jace's Erasure, man, doesn't do squat. There you go. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that little matchup. I was scared for a second that there was going to be that control deck I was describing, because... They were running the same types of stuff, but I don't know how the hell they think this is going to work with what they got going on. So, I don't know, but hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like on the video. Make sure to subscribe. Stay tuned next week for more Naya Slivers. And tomorrow we've got some Call of Duty coming up. If you're interested in Call of Duty, check out the video. And we got our Sunday Booster Kraken coming up. Part 2 of Winds of the Ominous Moon for Force of Will. We're opening up the rest of the box. How can we do? Go find out. We'll see you guys there, and we'll see you guys in the next video.